Hello, welcome back at the channel of World Style Knowledge by Omay Hassan. Today I bring a very heart touching story about reactions for you. It's my most favorite story. Every day that we live on this earth, we make choices. Things happen, we make decisions and that shape our life. It's that simple. But do we put enough thought into how we react to things that happens to us? Sometimes we are so busy that we just react rather than we think. Our reactions affects our relationships. Once upon a time, a daughter complained to her father that her life was miserable and that she didn't know how she was going to make it. She was tired of fighting and struggling all the time. It seemed just as one problem was solved, another one soon followed. Her father, a chef, took her to the kitchen. He filled three pots with water and placed on a high fire. Once the three pots began to boil, he placed potatoes in one pot eggs in the second pot and ground coffee beans in the third pot. He then let them sit and boil without saying a word to his daughter. The daughter mourned and impatiently waited, wondering what he was doing. After 20 minutes, he turned off the burner. He took the potatoes out of the pot and placed them in a bowl. He took the eggs out and placed them in a bowl. He then ladled the coffee out and placed in a cup. Turning to her, he asked, what do you see? Potatoes, egg and coffee, she hastily replied. Look closer, he said, and touched the potatoes. She did, and noticed that they were soft. He then asked her to take an egg and break it. After pulling off the shell, she observed the hard boiled egg. Finally, he asked her to sip the coffee. Its rich aroma brought a smile on her face. Father, what does this mean? she asked. He explained that the potato, the egg and the coffee beans had each faced the same adversity, the boiling water. However, each one react differently. The potato went into strong, hard and unrelenting, but in a boiling water it becomes soft and weak. The egg was fragile, with the thin outer shell protecting its liquid interior until it was put into the boiling water. Then the inside of the egg became hard. However, the ground coffee beans were unique. After they were exposed to the boiling water, they changed the water and created something new. So, my dear, which one are you? He asked his daughter. When adversity knocked on your door, how do you respond? Are you a potato, an egg or a coffee bean? You also ask yourself, 